downhill racing is often referred to as the Formula One of mountain biking. You know what Formula One ain't? Cheap. You ever Very tried true. to buy a Formula One car? No. Anyway, I can you ride an old cheap downhill bike hard and fast? Today we're going to find out with the presenter challenge. Ooh, nah. Blake, what bike have you got? Oh, Neil, oh. I've got an absolute, look at it. <laughs> kind of stinky deluxe. Doesn't look very deluxe. It no, is it deluxe, it's deluxuous. It's green, look at it, it's got a DMR sticker. I got an oi oi saddle. So that's like, right now, this is like, it's the most up to date thing. part of the whole bike. It is, yeah. Monster tees, which I actually them. swapped it out for. They had some junior tees, Mazzocchi on there. I actually swapped them because they were broken because the price I got it for was an absolute bargain. I got a Hope front hub. And I think that's a Mavic that's the best D3. Bit. Is that a Saint? Who that's a Saint Caliper. Talk about, oh, it is as well. Saint Caliper. Can't even think of that. But I got a Sabertooth Tiger for sure. rotor. Look at that. Yeah. Stopping power is going to be not so good there. Richard, what you got? Well, Neil. Da, 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 da. Oh. Monster Tees again. The Mongoose Black Diamond, circa 2006. Monster Tees, two shock positions, Neil, ahead of its game, you might say. An Andrew Needing replica. It is indeed, yeah. You know what yeah. that bike is? It's a URT, which basically means it doesn't work. That's a rubbish turd. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> right, well, I'm stoked up. Fun stem, skeletal brakes. Skeletal? Uh, yes, skeletal, still a thing. Um, seat doesn't go any lower because it will hit the shock. <laughs> Otherwise, I think we're good to go. No, Let's that. Get that. The tires. Black Diamond, right? Could you hit Black Diamond? No. We'll find out. Neil, what have you got? Oh. That whoa. is a Da Vinci Wilson. Ah, it's actually not. the most up to date of all of these. Boxers. It's got a boxer up front. It's got old Holy brakes. It's got Stevie Smith bars. Oh. Holy cups. Are they oh. cups? Are they cup are forks? Way too wide because they're wider than the bike is long, mammal <laughs> bars. <laughs> this is actually sport. a medium and it is, feels like a child's bike. Black box Stevie Smith bars. But I'm quite happy with that. No, yeah. yeah I I just don't wobble yeah. the rear end. It's a bit floppy. You got a grease snip off for your. It hasn't been oh, used. Yeah. You've got a grease nipple. You, you get that? them on tractors, right? You've seen how it's been painted over. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> never been used. <laughs> well, what a, what a lineup of weapons we have. Incredible. All 26 inch wheels. 26 ain't dead. Today they aren't. All right, two terrible bikes and one that looks all right to me. Yeah. But it's yeah, time mine. to see what our first challenge is. Yeah. Here we go. Well, here he is. Big man. Big man with a big envelope. What have we got, Neil? It's shiny. Gold. Challenge number one the price. Is all important, I guess. Yeah. Come on, guys. Let's be honest now. How much do you each spend on your bike? The cheapest and best value. That's 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 a different thing. Yeah. Right, yeah. Well. Uh, it gets three points. But be careful. Going too cheap could catch you out later. As for every mechanical throughout our day filming, you'll lose one point. Oh lord. Oh, 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 no. We're going to puncture. Someone's going to puncture. Yeah. Anyway, oh. Blake, how much does yours cost? <sighs> Mine cost three hundred and fifty no. pounds. Three hundred and fifty quid. But I. It was cheap for an obvious reason because at a closer inspection, the front fork, the Mazzotti Junior Tees were cracked and I actually put my personal Monster Tees on that I bought in 2005. Pretty Whoa. cheap, fair. Yeah. Richard? 500 big ones for this, this fine example of a downhill bike. Half a grand, you could get some. Half a grand, don't say it like that, that half sounds terrible. Grand. Half wow. a grand. Wow, Neil. 550. Ooh, oh, it's not more bad. More than half a grand. What have I done? I've changed the cranks, put some fresh grips on, ready to roll. I would like to say, I've done nothing to this. Oh. oh. This is... Doesn't look like it's been ridden very much, to be fair. It actually looks orange. I mean, why would you want to ride it? Yeah. No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I, it's a play. Technically, technically you get the points. There we go. Rich, two, yes. three, I get two. one. Now, the prices have been given. It's time for the next challenge. <laughs> oh, big man. Are we going to ride? Gold envelope time, let's see what we got. Number two, he's rather big, isn't he? Look at him. Challenge number two, whip off on A470 trail here at Bike Park Wales. Straight uh, in, no warming up then? No, straight in, it, by the looks of it. Free ride rig, man. Gonna Free get rider. Side, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Style points are just as important as going fast. No, not true. Yeah. It is true. <laughs> what about riding for 24 better. hour points? All right. No. <laughs> Each rider is going to have three goes of putting the best looking whip down the A470 trail. Three goes, no warm up, three goes. Three goes. Bike won't last that One long. One go for warm, two to try. All right. Yeah. The winner, however, the cameraman will be judging who gets 
the best sideways whip. Well, I'm going to swap out this for a full face. I would, because <laughs> that front end looks rather cheesy. You know, I've bribed one of the cameramen. He's got one of my e-bikes currently at the moment. So, you oh, know. Mine's no got brand. the other e-bike. No. So you're coming last. No, no. To the trail then. Right, we're here at the top. First impressions of your bike. We had to ride here. Dreadful. Oh. Plush. Plush. Is it? I quite like mine. Yours? Mine feels good, except when you take off, all I can feel is a front wheel bearing. And, <laughs> mine just goes bang through the travel. I have the very, I have such narrow bars. Feeling confident about whips? Mm. Got loads of space to move the bars. Yeah, watch this. All right. We've all put in two runs. <laughs> this is the final countdown of whips. How are you finding it? Uh, yeah. It's, all right. it's funny, it's crazy riding a weird bike, isn't it, Neil? Yeah, this bike feels pretty good so far, so um, yeah, I'm into it. Oh, okay. I feel all right. I've got really narrow bars. Ah, I feel good. Feels like we're doing what we did in the 90s and push up all the time. <laughs> and he sends. Oh, oh my god, the crowd go wild! Oh. Hey, nailed it! What, was that one? what do you think, cameraman? Well, Judging! Right, cameraman, put us out of our misery. Who, uh, Whose whip was winning? The winner is. <gasps> Blake. Three points. Stinky. Stinky. Deluxe though. It's the official supplier to the Ma uh, Whistler Man Bike Park, that bike. In 2004? Yeah, probably, yeah. Second place for two points? It's Neil. Uh, I thought it might be. Well done, Don. I'll take that one point. I'm happy with well that. Well done, boys. Well done. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Right, we're back down at the cafe, and I think it's time for another challenge. Let's see what we've got. Big man, thank you. Okay. Da, 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 da. Challenge number three, desirability. Everyone wants their bikes to be cool. Your challenge is to ask people around the park to pick the coolest. Uh-oh. Let's go and find some punters. Eyeing up the bikes already. I can, I seen you checking out the three we've got here. Looking at those, yeah. If you had to pick one, Excuse Blake, out of the way. Which would it be? The one with the red forks. Oh, that's the Da Vinci. Okay. Good choice, excellent choice. Right, I, I wouldn't have chosen that one personally, but thank you very much. Right, let's find someone else, thank you. Okay, let's go to this uh, table. Hey up gents, how are we doing? Yeah, very good, yeah. very good. Very good, right, desirability time. We've got our three retro downhill bikes lined up over here. <laughs> if you've got to choose one, what are you going for? Uh, I think the mongoose. I'd go with the mongoose as well. I'd go with the Kona. Hang on. Right, this round here. You. I've done mine. The mongoose with the box of forks. Oh, okay. Combo. Hang on. Yeah, I'll go with the mongoose as oh, well. Oh, Kona all the way. Oh, this guy's biased. And? Mongoose. Wow. Would you look at that? The mongoose. I didn't count. How many votes was that one? About four votes for the mongoose. Hello, guys. How are we doing? Okay, desirability time. Our three retro bikes over there. I'm not saying whose is who, but you've got to pick one which you think is the fast, fanciest. Kona. Okay, well, I'd definitely go for the Mongoose. It's proper old school. <gasps> Mongoose, it's proper old school. Hang on, and? It's going to even you out because I like the one with the red triple clamps. Ah, that is an old Da Vinci. Okay, wow, the Da Vinci finally getting a vote there, but the Mongoose still coming off pretty strong. Gents, the results are in. I've not counted, but I don't need to. The Mongoose won. <laughs> And I'm not even voting for the mongoose, and it's mine. Ah, uh, how is that possible? Look how ugly it looks. So it's three points to the mongoose, the arguably the most horrendous bike here. T two points 
to the Kona. That's yours, Blake. Dude, I'm afraid. What I mean, come on. <laughs> People are just wrong. <laughs> right. All right. There we go. People are wrong. You're all wrong, people. Sorry. <laughs> Mongoose, I got three points. Lovely. I feel another challenge coming on. Yes, indeed. Where's big man? There he is. Ah! The gold envelope is back. So this is challenge number four. Oh, handle the whoops. Whoops. Super cross. Supercross, time to what test your bike's suspension. We're going to film some slow mos of you hitting the Moto Whoops on Vanta line. Oh, we said Anaheim. Yeah, uh, A1. No, the bike that stays the stillest over the Whoops stillest. wins the point. Survives, more like. <laughs> okay. Good luck. Yeah, good luck, everyone. Okay, well, to the Whoops. To I, the whoops. I think faster might be better, you know. Oh my gosh, this thing's horrible. Whoa, I hit recording job, you can't ignore it. I'm transforming now these cars and planes, I'm always boarding. Just out touring down in Charlotte like I play for Hornets. When I'm performing, never boring, now you can't afford it. Champagne Perrier. Right, so we've reviewed the footage and um, I looked really horrible. Short <laughs> wheelbase, the crap geometry. Yeah. Steep it's between, angle. It's super steep, difference. yeah. But I feel like it's between you guys. And I, th I think it went... I think it went to Neil, just. It went to Neil. Yeah. I've got the advantage of, I reckon, two or three more years on there. So the angles on this bike are pretty good. It feels actually really good. It's small. It looks good going yeah. through. I'm enjoying it. That is still quite steep. And your URT rear end, so yeah. that back end doesn't move that well. I'm just pleased to get through it. So <laughs> congrats. Although Andrew Neathan did get a top 10 at a World Cup on it's that. Very, very true. He did. Very true. Well, so, congratulations. Neil. Three. The dream. Dos. Uno. Uno. <sighs> Next challenge. Challenge five then. Challenge five, where is big man? Big man? Oh, huh? Neil? Oh. Neil? He is big, isn't he? Whoa. Big man. He's a tall guy. Can you, get, can you eat it? <laughs> what have we got, Neil? Challenge uh, number five is, all right, fastest Daniel bike through the rough stuff. We're gonna put your bikes, as well as your nerves, again, to the test, see who has the highest speed through a rock garden. Rock garden, you love rock this gardens, This feels Neil. more dangerous than <laughs> riding <laughs> Rocks, right, let's rocks. go find Rimdinger, maybe? Rimdinger, dinger, dinger. Blah, blah. Come on, he's a big, big man, isn't he? Big man's a big man. Oh, that's two of us, Neil. That's, yeah, but you're a little man. True. Rimdinger sounds not very inviting, does it? No. no. But we've got a speed gun, and we're going to go as fast as we can down here. Officer Samson on duty. I am Officer Samson, and if you do not go fast enough, you're gonna buy lunch. You don't you know go what? fast enough. No, it's fast all about speed truth. on this one. Fastest and one wins. You know, this is not the modern era, these bikes. I was gonna say, I lost so many races in the late 2000s. Due to punctures, that's gonna be our problem. We're all running tubes. No tubes, tubes yet. Yeah. 26 inch tubes. Tube. Right, there's a fast section just down there. I'm gonna stand there. See how the Neil gonna drop, Rich, you're gonna drop, and I'll drop last. Send it! <sighs> Ready? Do it. Dropping in. Okay, now it is between the two races at the top. Neil and Rich have raced. Neil done downhill. We all know that. Rich has done enduro. I am a free racer, but I'm going to give it my absolute helpful leather. So let's see who's coming. Predict it. 42, 43. It's all because of that drop. If you are able to send that drop, you're in for a win. Forty-three. I'll take that on this thing all day long. I think me and Blake will be pretty tight. I reckon. I reckon that bike isn't going to be as fast. The angle is, is rough. I don't feel like that bike's going to be that good at plowing over rough stuff fast. True. But Blake has momentum on his side, should we say? He's very. He's quite a dense human being. I shan't add anything to that. Ew. 44, 43, 44, 45, 44. 45 is my limit. Here he comes, look at him pedaling, look at him. 
Yeah. yeah. Nah, he doesn't look as. Oh, nah. Nah. 46. 46? Yeah. By 1k? Ah, yeah. oh, nil! <laughs> Done by one! 46. I got 45. 46. 43. 43. Oh, that's good. Some pace still, isn't it? That is pacey. That's some pace down there still. Feels fast, doesn't it? Yeah. It feels so on the limit, like it's so on the edge. That like, feels like downhill properly, like yeah. ball man. Yeah. That, there's that right, little right-hander. Yeah. That's oh, the one like where you glances just towards the tree. Yeah. You're like that. You can see your like, elbows in. I tried, I was looking at the slab gap so you can straighten yeah. it. Yeah. So the results are in. The Don, 46K an hour. The Samson, 45k an hour. The Poon, 43. So oh. three points, two points, uno. Nice! Uh, my skeletal brakes don't slow down that good, I'll be honest. My Shimano Dior's is not <laughs> with Saint, with Saint enduring very well. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's the last challenge time. Where's Big Man? It's Big not man. hard to find. There he is, fapping size of him. How Oof, big he is? He's Massive. so big. Fapping state of him. <laughs> anyway, of this him. is the last challenge, everyone. <laughs> yeah, uh -oh. that one is a serious one. It says serious. It's Whoa. a downhill race. Getting serious, going fast on a full run is ultimately what these bikes are built for. Obviously, Actually, for that's down. more of a free ride bike, if I'm honest. Free racer. It's got bottle cage, mate. So that sort of says it's not a downhill bike. Okay, but, uh, <laughs> all right. You know. So we're going to be racing down 50 shades of Black right there, not grey. Nice. The Bike Park Wales has a timed run. Fastest one wins, but there's a lot more to fight for on this challenge. Okay. Double points is Whoa. up for grabs. Double points. Double points. So that's six for first. Gone. Four for second. Nailed it. And two. <laughs> oh, it's the full house. He's done it. <laughs> ah, yeah, big man. <laughs> right then. To the start. We're at the start. <laughs>
Right, the times, I've checked the GoPros. Uh, Blake, you set off first. You went straight into the hot seat. Yes. 4.02. Nice one. Uh, nice one. Until Rich came down, he did 3.59. Oh. And then you up by three seconds. Sorry, and then man. Neil, that's me. That's you. He came <laughs> yes. down at uh, 3.27. Oh my God. Uh, Close sight, we got his <laughs> <laughs> I got two points. Quick maths. No. Yeah. Yes, correct. I two, got four. four. Double points. You got the double points. And you so got, got six. six points. So what is the points in the overall then? I do not know. <gasps> big man! How did you oh. reach him? You shrunk. You got actually big man. Neil's grown. Really quick maths, sir. So the final points. Oh. I mean, really these points go to the bikes, not to us. That's true. It's very true, yeah. It's all about the bike. So in joint second place. <laughs> what? Or should we say joint last? Uh, well, Blake and Rich with yeah! oh, nice. the win in the race it gives me 16 points and take the win. What wow, so what did we what did points did we get? Uh, 13 each. Unlucky oh, for unlucky some. Unlucky for some. Lucky for me. The question been... is, the bikes. Uh, I've really enjoyed riding this. The real question is, would you take that bike home and ride it? Richard? No, not in a million years. It was horrendous. It was it was a rough ride. I think but, that does it predated. Yeah, it's, it was funny. Blake? Yeah, ugly, that thing. Oh, uh, right. me, I would take this Most home. I'd take this home for sure. <sighs> Neil? I would, definitely. I think a couple of simple upgrades. This bike would be well good. The mm. brakes are good. Everything works. It's a bit rattly. But yeah, I've really enjoyed riding it. Actually, I'm going to do a backup video where we talk about these bikes, how much they cost us, how, if we didn't have to do any work to them. So can you buy a good downhill bike for less than £500? I'll follow up. All right, boys, that's it then. We're done for the day. Neil, congratulations. You blitzed us. Well done, yeah, nice. Right, today it's the Cheap Bike Challenge. We've all been given £100 each to go away and buy a cheap mountain bike. And today we're going to put them to the test. Oh my God, Elliot, a trick! Go on, Doddy. <laughs> oh my god! Who grip he's got! <laughs> Beaver's been here, ate that tree. Oh! One, two, three, idiots. One of us is gonna die. A load of challenges, we don't know what they are yet, but I've gone for the retro bike. Cost me 60 quid this, the Peugeot Lynx Africa GTI, I think it's called, from 1987. Got 15 speed, everything's original, except for the grips and the uh, pedals, they've been upgraded. <laughs> Dolly, what is that? This is my uh, Italian handmade. Handmade? Steel. 100 quid. Duck Ale. It's probably Ducale, but Duck Ale. Duck yeah. Ale. It's a high 10. It is, yeah. So it's got some really cool features on it. It's got a um, matching uh, grip shift at Tomac Road with uh, a fake Vetter yeah. SL saddle. But 100 quid. And it's got prototype uh, Maxxis Mini and SS. It's got suspension. Oh. That's dual suspension. <laughs> now, what is that? Let's go, look at this. How much are you supposed yep. to spend? That was oh, not. 100 pounds. 100 quid. 100 quid, yep. 100 quid, 100 really. 100 quid. Yep. Really, Blake. Full suspension, what's that? <laughs> You've got a shock work shock. I remember Shoreline that. Shoreline trail. Yeah. Uh, that's like four inches of travel. Your stem is longer than your bars are wide. That's four inches of travel. Uh, it's full suspension. James Holloway and Dave Hemming used to race these. See, now that's why I thought. I thought I'd go for one of them. They were quite expensive back then. 100 quid. It's kind no, of a little bit me. skew if, but. 100 quid. I like how you got your tires on backwards to sort of. Yeah, that is for extra grip when I do. Tell you what, I hope, I hope one of the challenges is seat bounce challenge. <laughs> yeah, that is pogo -y. I did wind it up because I didn't want it to be soft. This is a classic. It's a thing of beauty, isn't it? This is what I first started on. I had a 24 inch wheel version of this. It's wow. all right, isn't it? Yeah. The, the brakes, yeah. not so good. Right Look how long those chain stays are. Chrome plated <laughs> uh, rims plus uh, cables have not been replaced. You know Try one finger braking. That's like a clutch lever. It doesn't even go in. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't even go. It's like a 1980s motorbike clutch lever, isn't so it? So mine's made in Italy. <laughs> made in France. Made, France. Where's, where's yours, Blake? Marin. <laughs> yeah, it's, made in. It's, it's, it's not made in Marin yeah, County. Marin County. <laughs> Mountain bikes were born in there, weren't they? <laughs> yeah, so, not that one. Marin County. Friction shift, none of this index stuff. So. Flummies, cool. yeah, index. There's a lot of friction. Do you know what, with ah. the chrome wheels, good luck being a bit muddy out in the woods. <laughs> it's not going to work. 
Uh, my tyres have got like a single ridge down the middle, so super, it's super fast. fast on the road. Mm. But when you lean over, you're going on to the knobbies. Ah. You know look at the geometry like? of this. It's ingenious. This is modern geometry. I like the, like the, the tyres. I think mine looks cool. Yeah. yeah. That's all right. Duck ale. Prototype Maxxis tyres. Zoom suspension fork. Do they, do they, is, is that the fastest fork in the town? Oh, it's got so much top out, it hurts. <laughs> Tires look pretty fast. They are, yeah. I like the you got some nice grip. On there's the a edge. bit of a weird transition to the cornering knobs. Looks like a fairly budget. Old Very. -ish but, bike. I'm, I'm like quite keen on the sort of magnolia wallpaper kind of paint job. But so. very, very Italian. Hang on, you've got a mate there. Oh, Italian. Italian. Duck egg Manola. Where's Duck egg Manola. <laughs> Where's your kickstand gone? Hey, you're, we're all running three by. Yep. 15 three by. Years. I've, 15. Got, I've got a bash guard. So if there's a climbing challenge, I think we're all going to be even. Maybe me with a bit more traction. Mm. Mm. Right, let's do a. Oh, what's this? Number one. <laughs> oh, what is this? I was wondering who's the postman coming in with it's the your post? P45, this is, mate. Oh. <laughs> Do you want to? No. Brake test. <laughs> <laughs> Your brakes don't even work. We're talking Before about it. Before we go, we need to check. We can stop. Well, I know I can't stop. I'm a front All brake. Right. I'm pretty confident. You yeah. conf I feel well, like... the brakes work, but I've got no traction. <laughs> mm. Okay, so what is it in a... We just have to stop wherever yeah. it stops first. We're we'll ride along side by side. <laughs> right. Stops first is a winner. Cool. Three, two, one, stop. Hey, hey, army! My front brake goes under the rim. Two fingers weren't effective. I might need to go for four fingers. I think you need to just get to pull my thumbs as well. <laughs> <laughs> nice. So, verdict, I think Neil, you don't have brakes. That is full gas with one finger. <laughs> Good luck on the trail. You'll be the fastest, that's for sure. All right, so who's going to win this Pro Bike Challenge then, right? So just to explain this, we're going for the nearest like to like to what we have today. So, which is the lightest? Well, clearly, this is the Duck Ale. So. I win this category. Um, <laughs> gears, bearing in mind that it's, it's more fashionable, more appropriate to have one by 11, one by 12. Oh. The nearest to that is you. I could even is that, go, is that 15? I, I could go one by five if I wanted to. I'm yeah. oh, so far five oh. speed category, that. it's insane. But um, suspension, who has the most? Yeah. Well, got the an enduro bike. Suspension. Got an enduro That's bike. That's me. Yeah. 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 Um, <laughs> head angle, ironically, the slackest e. is Neil. I got it right the first time around. You know, we're talking about a classic here. They made a Peugeot 205 GTI. And this then they like stopped the, making good cars after that, equivalent. to be fair. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That was the last of a good stint. <laughs> but, uh, oh, Neil, uh, bar width, you win that one as well. Yep. You've got the widest bars, just and you've got the shortest stem. Yes. You've just put your, your grips out further. And it's the and, best looking. And if we were going to have long chain stays, you'd win that as well. <laughs> so it's got those too. Oh, wow. And it's got cyclocross brakes on it. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. All round. So pretty much Neil wins, Pro I think. Bike. Yeah. We'll see you on the trail, though. We'll <laughs> see if your brakes work on that trail. I, I don't know if he's going to win that challenge. I don't think he is going to win that challenge. <laughs> Time to get these beautiful beasts out onto the trail, and the bikes too. Mm, I don't envy you, Neil. Get the top of snow or something. Wow. This is where I fell off last week. <laughs> One, two, three, idiots. One of us is going to die. Straight down to a... I don't like the look Amy. of that sign. Oh, the oh, challenge. That's... Oh, hello, here we go. Oh, what have we got here? Let's take a guess at what What this might could be. we have here? Well, we've just hiked up the worst trail ever. <laughs> and predictably, we're going to race down the tech descent. <laughs> <laughs> descent back down what you just pushed up. Fastest time wins. A wreck. <laughs> Don't put you, he's, we're putting him in a race perspective. You, that means you're like, with no brakes, it's going to be the fastest. <laughs> wow. <laughs> See what happens. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Don't snap my chain. <laughs> oh my god, nearly a tree! <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha
I keep changing gear. Oh. Yeah! I survived! Have you engaged downhill mode on your zoom fork? Um, yeah. 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 <laughs> Three, two, one, go! Well, to be honest, when I come into corners, because I've got these massive grip shifts, I keep going in the turns and I got no gears, but that was so flipping fun. I dread to feel what, like what Neil's gonna feel like coming down here. Here comes Doddy. There is a tricky section up there. Like you could go horribly wrong. Go on, Doddy! Watch that tree! <laughs> yeah! God! Blimey! <laughs> I can't even see it. Well. <laughs> oh, it's just the arrow control the whole way. How much fun is that? I'm going for three fingers on the brakes, my thumb and my little finger grasping onto the bars. Three. Oh my god! What was that? How can you tell if I did off it in my face? <laughs> oh, lucky you're wearing like padded pants because holy moly. Here comes Neil. Oh wow, Neil. Dude, dude, he's going to be fast. He is going to be fast. <laughs> Look at him Brent go! <laughs> His feet are on the pedals. I, I couldn't even ride down that. Watch that tree, Neil. Oh, oh he's pedal. <laughs> he is, I reckon he's got. Look how fast he is! <laughs> Told you he'd be like the quickest, though. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, nice. I mean, they sound good their age, don't they? Well, our gear's changing. We're going to need them, I reckon. My headset's There's a climb coming up. very loose. <laughs> Is it? Clunking. I'm not surprised. How many gears have you got? 15. Good luck. There's a climb coming up. Only 10 of them work. He's got a bigger range of gears than you, though, Blake. Has he? Yeah. Oh. He's got a smaller small gear and a bigger big gear. <sighs> oh. Fire road climb. Fire road, man. What's that all about? I don't know. But that, it's sending us <sighs> to a steep path. Oh, Neil, so you made it. Time. I thought you were going to get it's that. It's like we're buying gears again, is it? Do you know what? You're, you're struggling up that. <laughs> That's your friction gears, isn't it? Make oh. sure you don't get like a... Oh. Wait. Challenge. Do you know what it is? No. Come on. <gasps> Techie climb. You've got the gears, but do you have the skill? <laughs> Tech climb challenge. Furthest up the hill, this hill. Oh, dude, that's steep. Don't fancy this, the chances. This hill, the furthest up this hill wins. Well, we're both running slicks. You've, you've got mountain bike tires. <laughs> you've got a, a bottle cage that's going to weight your no front No excuses tire now. That's a cross country stem riding for you, position. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> a bit worried for you, Neil, because you're struggling going up that. Right. Who's first? I reckon he's got quite a wide range of gears on that, though. He might be right. I've got the f most gears. Neil's going first. Yeah, he's going, he's going for a run up. I don't use my thumb he wants, I'm going. Go on, <laughs> Go on Neil. Go on, dude. You look like you're struggling already. <laughs> oh, he's bad. getting there, he's Not getting too there. too bad, you got some, got some diesel in those legs. Oh, out the saddle. <laughs> don't snap that chain. <laughs> oh, oh. He's up, he's up. <laughs> ah. That's so quite, is, that, is that, that the summit? That's quite good. See if you go that way. We need to go further. Yeah, you got through the mossy bit. All right. Good luck. I think I have got a disadvantage with full suspension. The I bomb. don't. 
No, you got traction though. There you go. You got loads of traction. To, I was nah. Don't talk your way out of it now, nah, Blake. Yeah. That's all but. Go on, Doddy. Doddy's got the legs of a of an ox. <laughs> he potentially could do well. <laughs> the Italian climbing machine. <laughs> Ducati. The British. <laughs> Go on. Oh. That wasn't bad. That's not bad. I'm quite nervous. It's that massive cassette you've got on. Wheel spinning. Is that a 50 tooth cassette? It's a, yeah, it's a prototype SRAM Eagle is what it is. Yeah. Good work, Duck Ale. <laughs> Climbed quite well. Soars like an albatross. Quite nervous. I'm going to go full hammer. I am not going to give two ticks about them two. <laughs> Full sprint mode. Come on, who rode Marin in the 90s? Uh, Blake Samson. Earthquake oh. Jake Watson. Earthquake Jake, yeah. Who's a downhiller? Yeah, true. Earthquake, I'll make an earthquake because I'm going to summit this beast. Ready? What? <laughs> you what, M9? <laughs> that looks easy on that thing. Your stem is like so. Look at the grip he's got. It's my stem. Oh, oh my <laughs> gosh. More power. <laughs> More oh, power. More. Yo, I mean, that's uh, oh, some going. <laughs> Next challenge. You ready? Hopefully, it's like trick challenge. <clears throat> Bike vault. Yeah. Three minutes. Best photo wins. Time starts now. All right. Come, Tom. We're going to the sunlight. Let's go this way. Keep running, Tom. Keep running. Oh! Right, I'm not pedaling it. Oh, that's quite nice, actually. A trail in the background. Got to line your, uh, your tyres up. Propping the bike up, the magic stick. Nice autumnal colours. Get me camera ready. Come down here. Run, Tom. Don't fall. Beaver's been here, ate that tree. Look at the sun. Sun, mountain bike, trail. We need to find a trail, Tom. I need a stick, I need a stick. It's not gonna work. Yes. Now yeah, there's my picture. I'm gonna edit mine because I want it to be a bit more orangey. Yeah. Maximize that. Oh, nice autumnal colors there. Maybe it's, uh, Fitting surrounding. Nice. I'm good. I'm good with that. Very nice here. Yeah? I think it'll do. Bike, drive side, pedals, three o'clock. It's against the tree. We've got the trail going over there. Look at that beast. I'm so proud of my bike. And so you should be. Look at that. I'm good with that. I can't, I can't get up into the sun in time. So I'm all right with that. Me and my bike on the trail. Pretty good for an old girl. Bit of nature, cool shot of the bike. It's a bit disappointing. Hmm, get a bit arty. Bit more trees. One more. That's the angle, bit of tree. Been getting another one here anyway. There we go. Happy days. We're done. How much time we got? 30 seconds. 30 seconds. I'm gonna take an edit. It's all in the editing process here now, Tom. All good. <sighs> And it looks great in its natural surroundings. Right, now I've got 30 seconds, I'm gonna stick it in Lightroom. 15 seconds. 15 seconds. <laughs> 10. <laughs> oh no, auto, auto. Lightroom, Tom, quick, Tom. How much time we've got, Tom? Seven seconds. Seven seconds, I, oh, it's my wife. Quick, seven seconds, three, five, four. No, that's fine. <laughs> Two, one. Auto. <laughs> Save it. I'm just going to be done. Blue sky, autumnal feel. Autumnal. Look, look at it. Perfect. Let's go back and let's win this challenge. We got ourselves a banger. Oh, look at that. Stood up. Time is up. Three minutes it was supposed to be. He's take a photo that was supposed to be super nice. I reckon he's taken three minutes to get down there in the he's light. He's ridden into the light, hasn't he? Yeah. Such he a likes shit. bending the rules, doesn't he? Bye.
pulling away. See you at the top, Tom. There he is. Bending oh. the rules as usual. Take your time, Blake. I know, this isn't free ride, Blake. Last well, some rule. It's supposed to be three minutes to get the photo, not ride down in three minutes to find where you're going to take it. Did you give up? Because that bike's so ugly anyway. <laughs> Rule can't, bending again. Can't pass it, the turd. You can actually ask Tom, the videographer man. Three minutes. And I had time to edit it as well. What, put a filter? Yep. <laughs> You're supposed to be back here in three minutes. Oh, really? Some yeah. Like... So nah. you take, take a picture and get back here? Three minutes? Nah. You didn't read it, you went <laughs> and threw it. Mm, it didn't say that. Yeah, it was the same rule as the 100 quid bike rule. That was a hundred quid. <laughs> <laughs> We've done a few challenges, boys. How are the bikes holding up? Mm, mine's, <laughs> mine's making a noise. That's, like, that's the standard top out I guess you get thing. with a high performance shock. Well, okay. You buy a bike for under hundred quid. Full suspension bike isn't going to stand up to too much abuse. No, yet. and the chain keeps coming off. And Doddy, your fork looks a bit suspect. Uh, you yeah, it feels a bit shonky, to be fair. My it's more... bike is not taking the abuse very well. The, Your headset's loose, though. The lower headset cup is moving in the frame. Oh, oh no, nice belled out head tube. It's overlyzed a bit, <laughs> I reckon. Uh, not really up to the big abuse. Well, so we got any... Oh, oh. That, no, another challenge. Thanks, Bob. Oh, mate. Thanks, mate. What do you think this is going to be? Check. It's a paycheck. <laughs> is it? Uh, <laughs> yeah, what have we? Oh, Blake, you might like this one. It's jumping. Huck your meat. <laughs> no, <laughs> no hucking going here. No. And send it over these tabletops. Most competent jumper wins. Well, I am. Is I like right jumping. Rider or no. biking? He, yeah. I love jumping, but then getting this thing in there, I'm like QRs. Like, to me, that feels like there was snap on impact. I mean, if I've got a dance, no, it's not slow, resting on that. And it's not too it's big. It's resting on the hub. It's just That's scary. Fine. It's like this little wire thing going through my hub. <laughs> holding my front wheel on. Imagine that gets off and you land, four, crash! That's happened before. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> You're gonna get that in the air. I'm tempted. <laughs> Doddy is scared. Doddy is nervous. If you're as tall I'm... as me riding a bike as small as this, you might be. I'm actually quite nervous for you. Here he goes off. Good luck. Ah! <sighs> oh! He's actually clearing jumps. Ah. Ah. I'm jump. not sure I'm even going to get over the first jump. You can. No, dude, it's terrifying. Is it? <laughs> it actually is. I like the uh, chips you've got on your chain. Oh, I'm a bit disappointed about that. I wouldn't. Oh, no, I would, I would, no, I would like to put some tape on it. Mm. That, that stresses me mm. out. Ah, that sort of thing. Patina. Well, I can't, I can't be. Well done. Can't be that bad. Good luck. Oh, yes, Johnny! Yes, Johnny! <laughs> yes, Johnny! <laughs> yes, Johnny! <laughs> 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 nice! That was pretty good. I think that's Steve Jones shouting at me in the woods. Oh, let's try him out. Full suspension, slope style bike. Oh. See if you can get your water bottle. Oh, that's a big jump. <laughs> Unsurprisingly, the full suspension of Blake's Marin combined with his jumping talents have proved a one-sided battle in this challenge. Neil put up a brave fight though, and the Peugeot is looking good. Go on then, what we got next? Okay, <laughs> trials trail. Ooh. Build your own short trialy traily loop. Ooh. Then race. 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 <laughs> Bloody hell! Oh, oh, Junior. Uh, Junior. Yeah. yeah. That basically is. Yeah. yeah. All right. right. I'm gonna pump this thing right up. <laughs> pump it. 
<laughs> Can't mess these settings. <laughs> yeah, don't mess with that. Dolly's already messed with that and made it real horrible. No, I made it better for you. You couldn't ride it before, now you can. Yeah. I don't, know if, I don't know what gear to go in, boys. What gear do you reckon? Big ring is pretty ambitious. Yeah, that is true. Well, it's dropped out of it anyway, so. <laughs> Blimey. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Yo, yeah, try that. <laughs> oh, he's done it. Come <laughs> <laughs> no This is a scary bit, though. <laughs> oh, <sh> <laughs> <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> Well done. Good luck on good. them logs. The first bit was good. Gear selection is key. Gear, well, <laughs> I've got one gear and once I'm going, I can't change it. <laughs> so hopefully it'll get me up that first bank, but I'm not feeling confident. Right. Three, two, one, go. Get on <laughs> <laughs> Wheel spinning on the log. <laughs> <laughs> this bit, yeah, is so scary. Like, is I try not to thought mm, hopping wise. Guys, done it before. Look at that. Oh, oh, straight through that one. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty. That I see it's like heat. Oh, I I, you are enough yeah. force. You'll go through it. Line choice. Oh. I saw it. Wow. Did you see line choice? Go, yeah. Whoa, that's fast. He's going <laughs> <laughs> um. Go ahead. No break. Let's see it. Just Hop it. No, I'm not on the wrong. <laughs> 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 oh, you nearly got <laughs> 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 Oh, that's ridiculous. That oh, wow. little bike looks like BMX on you. It feels like it. All right, so, um, well, we're ready now for yeah. the scores. So results. I have the results. Who's got the hand. best budget bike? Right, okay, so first up, brake test. I think we all knew this one. So, uh, yeah, yeah. Neil, unfortunately, you got a one on that one. That's pretty bad, man. Um, I got a two. Yeah, okay, and so you won that one, Blake. Oh, wow. One. You got V-brakes. I got brakes. I got brakes. Oh, yeah. I, got brakes. I know, go. they don't do much and the front one goes under the wheel. You should have stopped him fast there on your face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, over the bars. Right, so pro bike. Ooh. Blake. Oh. What? That is the most pro looking bike. It's really, when angles. It's really heavy though, isn't it? Went it's weird. Weird. Steep angles, Good long stem, downhill. narrow bars. No. All that stuff. Mine's uh, more modern than yours. I got yeah, a two on that one. Cool. What, so, you won pro bike? Yeah. He did. But look at it, the slack head angle, the wide bars, the short stem, the long chain yeah, stay. Yeah. And wide it, was, bars. it was mid weight. 15 gears. Don't need any more than that. That's pretty old, but it's... Uh, you do. It's not that bad. <laughs> right. right. <laughs> Downhill race. Okay, oh, so yeah. no surprise. This one we didn't no know. No surprise here. Oh. So, and Blake oh. in second. Oh, yeah. And what the <laughs> flipping I was down. surprised when I saw you on that last bit. Down oh, I've got to background. Happy with that. On free ride, I was probably laughing. Tech climb, so Neil, you yeah. got a one. Yeah. I've all about I got a two. Yeah. And you got a three. Three. No surprises all the way up to the top. What here. did our lovely viewers think about our bikes, Doddy, for the bike vault? Um, oh yeah. Well, Don't, I'm quite you. sad about this one because they, they overlooked it. You know, the Italian <laughs> beast was uh, sadly only got a one. Oh, uh, did you get many uh, votes? Did it? it didn't. No, no. And Blake, you got a two. What? Yeah. Retro. It, everyone likes retro. So we need to explain this. Our GMBN followers on Instagram actually voted who had the coolest picture. What? Which one was super nice? And it looks like mine was the super nicest. And then, um, and then on to jumps. Again, I don't think any surprises oh, yeah, here. Yeah, 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 mine was quite terrifying. <laughs> um, Neil's, wherever you are. Yeah, it's and Blake's. Boring. Yeah. yeah, I was getting a bit scared when I was pushing it a little bit hard on the bigger jumps. QRs, man. 
think they're going to snap them. Yeah. This is really, really so this went off the time, who was fastest. Yeah. Um, bear in mind that Blake rode it all. Yeah. yeah no running. So, um, no so running, yeah. Didn't so Blake, cheat. You, got, you got a one. <laughs> what? <laughs> But I didn't cheat. And you had full spans. You could just rid him through those logs. Your, sure your rule was to have the bike between your legs, wasn't it, remember? Yeah, someone didn't have that between their legs. I had the bike between my legs the whole time. No, okay. No. <laughs> oh. oh, you got three points. Nice. Yeah. Wow. Cheat. All right. <laughs> now, <laughs> to the money. This is the important one. Oh, yeah, 100 quid. Speaking of cheats. 100 quid. <laughs> wow. Mine cost me 60 quid, so I've got to win that, surely. Yeah, 60. Yep. How much was yours? Uh, one. 100 pounds you put that. Ton. Mine was 100 pound. No, it wasn't. It was what was it really, Blake? Uh, 100 and, 130 pound. 130 quid. 130 quid. Yeah, you know, I thought right. you spend an extra out of my own pocket, 30 pound, so, to get a better bike. Great right piggyback. Does this give you a minus? No. Come on, let's see how the scores add up for us. Let's get this. Let's get this. Yeah. I won. Johnny won. won. My I mean, Neil won. won. Second, uh, me in third. Yeah. The thing is, I actually, I really like that bike. It's cool, but taking it off road, it's just not it's ideal. It's not suitable, is it? I actually think that's going to become my new commuter bike. And if I was to buy any bike in this room, it would actually be. The Mar Mar so you would turn an extra little bit of cash to make it a bit more viable. Quid. There's some decent tyres on it and a set of wider bars. Wider bars. Not too bad, really, tires, uh, Yeah. And it's upgradable. Like, mine's too old, you can't really do much with yeah. it. But that is, you could change everything if you really wanted to. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So for an extra few pennies, you get yourself a better bike that you can upgrade in the end. Yeah. Yeah, the less said about duck ale, the better, I think. I think yeah, it doesn't really that, sit in either camp. Yeah. It's not cool and old. And it's I mean, not, it looks it's not more achievable than usable. That. It's just a bit. That's crazy, isn't it? It goes to show that you don't really need a super expensive bike to have some fun out there on the trails. Oh, no, 100%. Really. It was great fun. You just need to have a little bit of skill, some fun, enjoy it with your mates, and then, yeah. Welcome back, you beautiful people. I'm out here with the king of free bike challenge and I brought my free bike. Whoa, whoa that ain't free. You uh, had to pay for yours. Uh, yeah. Mine's fully free. This is the champ of free biking. And we are going to do a game where we set tricks for each other and then do them. Let's get into it. Oof. First one. Air. Air? Air. All right. Let's get some air. First up, because we're both dirt jumpers, let's do a trick on this. What do you a reckon? Trick? Yeah. All right. Uh, what sort of trick? Hands off. Hands off. Any hands off, just like no hands. Yeah. Or tuck or suey. Whatever. whatever you want, just get your hands get off. Get your hands off. All right. Out of that. Yeah. I'm scared. Yeah, I'm a bit nervous. I've ridden this bike quite a bit, but. Not tricked. They're just scary, aren't they? They are very scary. Should I go first? Yeah, you said, yeah, go on, yeah. Oh, I don't You're know closer. which one to go for, because that's a long ass stem and that... Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yes! I couldn't even grip the saddle, so slippery! I'm gonna tuck no hander then if you did a suey. Alright. I think. <laughs> oh! <laughs> well, this bike's... <laughs> nice one. Next set. I do like air, but should we move on to something more like... Free ridey. Let's go steep. Oh. We've come to <laughs> one of the steep zones. Oh. There's actually three options we're going to take. So we're going to hit them all just to give a bit of variation to the ride. We're going to start off on the steepest one over there. There's a few routes. It's a bit of a drop and Blake's going to the hate it. Yeah, look at but this. his bike says FRS, which means free ride session. So let's get it on. <laughs> Right, Blake, we are now on the top of the fear zone. Oh. Few oh. routes to put you out of place and an Is actual drop? drop off. It's a drop, yeah. That you will be sending on your cheap bike. You can roll it though. No way, dude. Don't That's go too so quick. That's so scary. It's real crazy. Go quick, you say. No, don't go don't too go quick. Too You'll quick. go to flat. Go, go. You should probably go first though, because it's fun to, for me to watch from here. I can't even pedal backwards on this thing. Go on, Blake. Really? Yeah, yeah, I want to see it. You'll be perfectly fine. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Are you scaring me, dude? 
<laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. 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 <laughs> yeah. Let's see that. Like the roots are scary. Dropping in. Free bike challenge. Whoa. Uh, Whoa. <laughs> that bike looks so crazy. The oh. wheel, the wheel like frame, I mean the wheel spacing is so short, it's like easy to manual. It's like a jump bike. When is a free ride Look at bike? that steep one now. I reckon that one. With the that one looks corner and then. That one looks real slippery. There's a jump out of it as well. Oh, Sam's coming to the top. Oh, oh. that looks way scarier than that one because it's longer. And the entrance in is really hard. Oh, right, great. Like, I don't even really see it. Really scary. You ready? I'm steady. Dropping. Whoa! Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh my firing. god. Firing! <laughs> and you suit out! <laughs> Is that the challenge? Free bit! Free, Free bit! bit. That was Go nice. on in, Blake. That was nice. That was nice. You right. have to take your hands off. Or I a limb. A limb. A limb. Oh, off the old school bike tour trick. Can you think what it is? The one footer coming up. <laughs> yeah. I love that quite a lot of the time people ask me what's the best bike to buy. Honestly, any bike's the best as long as you're stoked on life. Get yourself a free bike. Well, don't go stealing, but you know, get a cheap one. You'll have loads of fun. Go on, Blake. Dropping. Get it. Whoa! 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 Yeah! That was about what as gift? extended as they used to be. That was sick. <laughs> That's how they were, yeah. No. I nearly went off that track there. Yeah, I saw that. So scary. What right, we've got another one now. That's not it for the steep oh, stuff. I thought that was... Let's move over there. All right. I say we come in from the side here and hit the more Traily turning, Traily right? turn. but we have to drift into the top for fun, okay? Okay. So you're gonna get a bit of a run up, slide in, foot down, and then, then get into not it. hit the tree. And not, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's watch you. He's coming in. Longest Hot. run up with no speed at He's all. Got... <laughs> oh. oh, oh, that tree! Oh no, okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, seats too high. What? That's, That's really fun. Uh, that tree buzz shoulder thing's quite yeah, my scary. My head hit something. Watch this. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so good. That tree. I know, it's so close. I like skidded to a halt though. I love how much fun it is on these bikes. Yeah. So much more fun. Look at that one. Do you reckon you can get into that rut? Yeah, sure. Will that crash and burn? That I don't know about. I can get into the rut. Let's try. Challenge. Free bit. Free bit. There's a sniper route. But we have to launch in. <laughs> Double in from there. Oh my God, I don't think you'll even get that. Double in. All right, spine this then. <laughs> All right, ride in. Yeah. But you start from that lump. Okay. <laughs> Oh, 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 Danny Mac! <laughs> Did you miss it? <laughs> no, I like sit out and then like do a roly poly on the bike. Ooh. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh! Whoa. Lucky I've got a Continental tire on the front, isn't it? <laughs> I have to do that again. Chain. Did you fully die then? Mate, I went. Oh, I didn't see it. Let's get a replay. Yeah, let's watch the reaps. Oh! 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 Yep. See it? That is crazy, Blake. I've got to try and do it again. Please. Free bit. Free, free bike it. Free bike it, free bit. Take that one home. Here we go. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh my god. Oh. And you, you even paid for that thing. You can't even turn corners. I on can't it. even turn a corner. I'll try again. Useless. The bike. Useless bike. He needs a free one. Then he'd do it first. Yeah? This time he's got it. Go on, Blake. It's because I haven't got my water bottle in my cage. Oh yeah. Should have <laughs> put Monty in there. And he could have cracked it hard when he landed. Crack it! Crack it! 
Yes. Again, no! <laughs> Danny Mac! <laughs> oh, he stopped it, that's way cooler. <laughs> Look at the route that you've unearthed. I know. So you can't not do that. Ow. Please do it again. We oh. all want to see that. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. Go, Ben! Freebing it. <laughs> no! Oh. I, can't I can't get in! How? I'll do it again. It's because I haven't got Conti's. Go, Ben! This is it. Yeah! Oh, finally! Yeah. Nice. Oh. Hey, you know what? That's a challenge. Yeah. That was super challenging. Yeah. But now I feel like we should get some more air. Oof. All right. We're gonna warm up on like a kind of bigger jump here, All right. and then we're gonna go into the biggest jump of this biking zone in there. Yeah. Okay. Let's. Right, I'm going to pick the first jump because I know Pilgs is local. This tabletop, it's about one. 30 foot, isn't it? Two. Three. three I've got bike, an idea. Lay down. Three bike lengths. Just lay down on it now. Dropping. Ah! Whoa, Whoa, you did it. Easy. Yeah, you laid down, Sam. I'm gonna try and clear you. Blake's not even jumped that bike before. Yeah, I have. Yeah, he did a little suey. Nah. I get my puffer How jacket dirty. How much speed do you need? How much? <laughs> Head. <laughs> Head in the drop zone. <laughs> Just roll in. Your case, but a bit Should of I a pedal. Should I have my saddle up? One pedal. Oh no. Oh! 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 That's so scary. Let's do like a bit of a stylish whip kick out on here. Well, let's try, try to. That was death grip into that. Yeah. Coming out soon, death grip too. <laughs> Dropping. Oh. That was really nice. Thank you. Your turn. That's what I'm worried about landing sideways on this thing. Dropping. Yeah! That was super dirt jumpy. That was cool. Nice. Potato. Oh. <laughs> I reckon we should go. Is it one a little bit bigger than that? Or is it just Fort Hammer? Can we jump a road as well? Can we, yeah, there's a potential gap of a road. Let's go to the bigger jump first. All right. Dropping. Sam Pilgrim dropping in. Big jump. Oh, it's a step in. Oh! Whoa! Oh my! That was quite high. That's I didn't know well was, good. I didn't know there was a step down into it. Yeah, it's super like freebie. Freebie. <laughs> Let me try. Oh! Yes! So good, man. <laughs> yeah. I thought I was going to land and the wheel was going to go right. Let's jump even further and land all the way into that soft, yeah? Cool. Okay. That's so fun on there. So good. Oh, I got a challenge. What? Let's swap bikes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Go on, then. Have a go on this. That'll Feel how well narrow funny. those bars are. Yours are like 800 oh, now. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, yours is like a giant bike. Wow, your suspension, like... Works, right? This is going to be so fun. <laughs> I send it. Oh, your it. pedals are dead. <laughs> my pedals cost more than the bike. Yeah. Egg beaters. No, those are clips. Oh, that was too easy for you. 
Because I'm such a free bike challenge guy. Yeah, you are the king of free bike. This is like my dream. Did Crazy. you see? Did you see my uh, craziness? <laughs> Let's see the Did replay. One Let's see the replay. Ooh, ooh, oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah, I need. Almost died. I want my bike back. It's way yeah. better. Yours is for giants. Too big for you, isn't it? Very. Too much Small travel. legs. Look how much travel. 800 and what? Five mil. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon another challenge. Yeah. I've got a good one. Right. We three it. Just onto the top. You don't have to clear it. All right. I haven't threed this. So. I've never threed this. Just go slow. Basically. Fly up three. Yeah. If you jump too far, you're disqualified. So you just have to land <laughs> here. All right. We Easy. just, no, okay, we both just roll in from there, so you won't have the speed, you know? Okay. Let's send that then. Right, three. This might lead to something else, maybe. A free 60. Oh, it's so good. I'm hey, gonna clear you, the whole thing, You man. nearly cleared the whole thing. Yeah, I'm gonna bomb it and free the whole thing. Hey, I'm just- three 60. <laughs> Oh, I'm going to do it again. Oh! oh, I hate this bike. Ooh. Pills is the king, though. Oh, wow. it's so good. I'm going to commit a little bit more and actually go a little bit faster. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Yes! <laughs> yes! No! That was so nah. good. I've got a well good challenge though. Oh, and we're going to get rid three. of this because yeah. the brakes are well sick. Yeah. And we're going to use your one only manual challenge. We're going to draw a line on the floor and just oh. see how far we can go. On Two attempts. Two attempts. Yeah. Fright. Winner gets a high five extra strong than the other guy that lost. Cool. Let's. Deal. Let's. Oh, white chocolate and lemon. <gasps> no. Ooh. Ooh. When would you risk? A... Would you risk it for a biscuit? Oh, the next biscuit challenge. Biscuit challenge. <laughs>We are over at the designated manual testing facility zone. We're going to get a bit of a run up from down there. I've now made a line on the floor as of this second. That is where we start the manual from. So I'm going to use this bottle. Whoever gets the furthest, best of two, wins the cookie challenge. Risk it for a biscuit. Please. Go for it, Sam. Maximum run up you can have is from this horse mess. Oh, he's flying. Oh, oh, that's so good though. What's the brakes like? It's like perfect for manis, because when you pull them, they don't work. He's got like, you know, like if this was chance that was good, he's got about this much of it. <laughs> oh my God. That was so short and small. Just, it's like your height. Just was. like my height. Yes. I feel very embarrassed. I didn't actually know what finger to use because the brake is really hard. Oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> that is... oh. No! Yeah, something like that. Come on then, Blake. Fuck the heck. That's, my... That's like a football pitch. Yeah. Have fun with this then. Thank you very much, mate. I'm getting that cookie. No, you're not. Watch this. Like now he knows a bit more about the bike. We're going to stay at the same scale of this, but he's going to be about there now, you know? He'll probably go two meters, not one. <laughs> go on, Blake, you can do it. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh that was so good. Damn, that was, oh. I wish I did that my first go. He definitely did better than I thought he was gonna do. Nice one, Blake. Wow. Well, but the cookie is mine. <laughs> Ooh, so, so, so cool, huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Nice one. Very good. That was, 
Next challenge. You said there's another manual challenge. I don't know if I could do it. Because you've got to step up. Big one. Same bike though. All right. We've got another trail here that leads into a little step up. And then there's a flat section here that then goes into a roll into a jump. We're going to jump up that bit there and land in manual, then into that rolling. That's the challenge. Two attempts. Let's. Same Please. bike. Same bike. Now that there is probably long, probably less than the one I just manual. For sure. So yeah. it's easy. You can go first this time. Wow. <laughs> I think he'll actually do all right. I reckon he'll get his front wheel to that tree there. So over halfway, we'll see. Oh, wow. That was incredible. Go again. She didn't know the speed. I'm hoping they don't that's that quite a big one. Huh? Oh yeah. I'll show you if you want. <laughs> That's horrible. It's not hard, is it? You just bike. <laughs> oh, That's I can't even get difficult. over the tree stump. Oh! oh. It's gonna happen. Well, yeah. You're the king. Do you wanna go back again? No, I have a go. I'll have a go after you. I haven't had a go yet. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I thought you were going to so jack it up and go down there like... Oh, that was so close. <laughs> wow, you're going so fast. Yeah. For me. Yeah. Are you going to do it, mate? I'll have a go, yeah. yeah. You have to bomb it. So fast. What, what finger are you using to break? Two? <laughs> Two? Yeah, I'm using one and I'm scared. That's well fun. I was like drifting while wheeling. It's real hard with a big stem though, isn't it? Cause yeah. your bike will go strange. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, broken. Oh, oh, got it. Get it, Blake. Oh, it's oh. I need to do it. It's Can't horrible. leave it unlanded. I'm not the one for this challenge. What gear are you in? No. Nah. King of freebies, man. King of free bike challenge. Sam Pilgrim, manual king. Sam, again, oh. another one. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. <laughs> that was freaking good. That was good, that one. Wow. I reckon we should jump the chasm of death. While we're here, yeah. Please, it's over there. <laughs> right, so when we were doing that manual challenge that obviously you did, uh, I saw this chasm of doom. Look how big it is. Yeah, this is this is actually so bad. Is it right? Like every like mostly every day someone gets like air lifted out of here because of this one gap. No. It's so big and so kicky. So you oh. can go first. And there's a 40 foot drop into it. But it doesn't mean we're not going to send it, does it? No. This is the, this is the, and this you're never supposed to say it, but this is the final feature of this episode. No, it's not. Don't say that. Don't say that. That's bad luck. That's like, touch wood, this is going to go all right. Oh, now you've got me seeing helicopters. <laughs> but when we crash it, we won't know what's happened because exactly. we'll be knocked out. So it's yeah. fine. Don't say that. Drop in. Should be good. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh! <laughs> wow! No, that, that is scary, scary, Sam. That is the I chasm. landed straight, right? But the mark of my landing looks like it's firing that way because my wheel went rat. <laughs> I'm gonna do it again and clear it. Whoa! Oh my. It you was so scary, I had to table it. <laughs> Incredible. Blake's gonna do it now so cleanly. 
that you could not even hear him land. Yeah, like you're local, you know this place. I've never hit this jump before. You never? No. Wow, you're so, wow, that's crazy. Never mm. hit it before. Look at my chain, look. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon I, I. Yeah, that's in, it's in. That worked really good. What, I call it the hacksaw? Stop trying to get out of it by speaking loads. Nah. He's, wait, he's hoping that it gets dark the amount of time he's talking so he doesn't have to do it again. Oh my god! <laughs> wow! I jumped over you! <laughs> that was well scary. I thought I had to table it over you so I could get more height. You bubba scrubbed me. Scrubber bubbing. Nice one, Blake. Potato. Potato. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Sam. Yeah, that's been awesome. Coming to your local spa. The king of free bike challenge. Thanks for coming and bringing a cheap bike with you. It's been well good. So I reckon we should do more. Hundred percent. I want to come over to you and see. Do that. you want to see more? I mean, that's the whole the whole thing is if you guys liked it, you should let us know below. Blake, if you had about five hundred pounds to buy a bike, what would you get? Silly question. Caliber Boss Nut twenty seven point five. Nice, I like it. Well, I would get a new proof scalp down bike. In fact, I did. You might have seen the video where I built this bike, an absolute bargain. 500 pounds, two really good cheap mountain bikes. Yes, they are. But which one's best? I don't know. Well, let's, let us know in the comments down below which one would you go for. But today we're at Windhill Bike Park and we're going to put these two head to head to see which one will be the best. Yeah. What would you buy for 500 pounds? Let's find out. This is my Caliber Boss Nut. Cost me about 600 quid off Facebook Marketplace. Uh, it is a medium sized frame, 130 mil of travel front and rear, 27.5 wheels front and rear. I've got a dropper post. I've got some beautiful Hope brakes here, hydraulic, so they're going to be working in the cold weather. The gear is on this bike. I've got a 1 by 11 setup here, and I've got a beautiful gold chain. Blake, 600 quid. I thought we said 500 quid. My new proof scale cost me about 500 quid. It's 26 inch wheel down on bike, 200 mil travel, rock shots boxer up front. It's a one by one, it's a single speed. So it might be a bit tricky getting speeds on the jumps today, but love this bike and it's an absolute bike. All right, challenge one, let's do some riding. Yeah. Drops and jumps, jumps and drops. I think pay rise is the best trail here at uh, Windhill Bike Park. Like I said over there, it was like, it tests the back end of any bike because the corners just, you G out, you know, rah, rah, rah. You know what? I would have said this bike would have been better. Jumps and drops, maybe the drops. You got so much travel. Yeah, I didn't hit the big one. 
Well, actually, that looks like it's really good as well. Oh, Neil, it's sweet as a nut, sweet as a boss nut, this thing. I'll tell you. So, what are we, we saying? A draw or what? I say it's a draw. I had some fun, did all the stuff, apart from the big drop, but. We need some bigger drops. Honestly, yeah. it feels bottomless to travel on this compared to what I'm normally on, so good. Next challenge. Calibre were one of the first bike brands to bring out great geometry mountain bikes for good value for money. Now this one cost me about 600 quid second hand. It comes with a drop post, hydraulic brakes, 27.5 wheels, all of that rad jazz. But this bike brand spanking new is a thousand pounds. I think that's good value for money when you get a drop and all these mod cons on a bike. Yeah, hard to argue with Blake's value for money. It's a great beginner bike if you're just getting into mountain biking, but we're comparing apples to oranges here. This is a downhill bike. This was raced at World Cups 2014 on their factory team rides, doing it on this thing. Uh, so this bike would have been thousands of pounds brand new. I've got an absolute bargain here. I'm not saying it's easy to come across it, but this frame cost me 90 quid. Bike cost me 500 quid in total. I've got to win value for money, surely. All right, downhill capabilities. This is like a monster truck. You kind of forget how bottomless 200 mil actually feels, like it charges through. It feels super solid as well. It's got such wide, like all the bearings and pivots. It's just kind of really good. You know, a bike works really well when it sounds incredible coming towards you on the trail. It, it does look the nuts on the downhills. This, to be honest, it's good, but it's not great. The head angle is quite steep. You've got a super high saddle. You've got 130 mil travel all around. And I kind of, when it gets a bit chunky like that up there. Yeah. Ooh. I think this wins, on but edge. however, the, I've set this up single speed, so I'm not helping myself that much. And on the flatter bits, it feels a bit overkill, British downhill tracks. But you know, if you had a bigger hill, a bit more elevation, this would win by a mile. Easy. But We're at the bottom. Should right. we get to the top? Yeah, well, I'm gonna have to push. Honestly, this gear feels so big, it's mad, like, you have to get up to speed before you can pedal it. Well, that's going to be hard going up hills with no dropper and 11 speed. Right, where's Neil? <laughs> now that's what I call good value for money. That's why I bought this. Basically, you can pedal back up to the top without pushing a big bike or a small bike. Anyway, Neil will be here in a minute. All right, cheap bikes. We've had some fun on them at least. Cool, we had some good times, Neil. I actually really enjoy riding this. Uh, it's kind of what I built it just for shredding down bike parks. But I guess, you know, the limitation of this, if you don't live near a big hill with an uplift, 
you just got to push it back up. So for me, it's going to be like an N plus one. It's a second bike to have. You know, ride your all mountain bike and then take this for some shredding. But I think as your only bike, it's kind of restrictive. Yeah, it does look cool. Actually, it sounded incredible on the trail, which I was a bit jealous. I was like, oh man, that's nice. But this, I still go with the boss nut. Why? Because it's 130 mil travel, you've got a dropper, you can go and hit the trails. Gents, today is a good day. Do you know why I've dragged you down the woods? Mm -hmm. I've got an email. Mm. It's Cheap Bike Enduro Challenge. Yes, yes guys. Go shopping. Mm, exactly. So I've given you 150 quid each. Yeah. You've gone out and got your bikes, right? We have. Have a look at this. Yeah! <laughs> Yes! Oh no! Oh. Oh. My chain come off! <laughs> yes, the bikes. I'm gonna kick it off. Now mine comes with a number of accessories, which I'll touch in a minute, but this is the Marin Mount Vision. It is 100 mil of travel, front and rear. Talk about the suspension, we've got the Fox Float 100. Forks on the front, it's uh, well serviced, not a leak in sight or a scratch. <coughs> Questionable. We've got the nice Fox rear shock, 100 mil. We've got conflict of interest on this bike, times two. First off is the drivetrain. We're running a SRAM on the rear with a Shimano XTR. Now that is gold dust right there. Another conflict of interest is, this is a Marin, but it's got Yeti grips. Let's talk about the accessories. First off, we've got a wing mirror, so you can see who I'm roosting behind, or who's behind me, to be honest, who's gonna overtake me. Next up, we've got this for the phone mount. I'm gonna put my phone in there, so for my navigation and that. But the best thing, right, is this thing right here. Listen to this. It's like a freight train coming towards you if I'm behind you. I can see how fast I'm going, how far I've done, and how much time I've spent on this rig. No dropper post, but I have got a prologue saddle. It's like a roadie saddle and all that, zoom seat post. I got my own Crank Brothers pedals on there in green. Shimano XT hub, Hope front hub, four pot front brake, two pot rear brake. They work, the gears work. Apart from the front, I have to actually manipulate that to get in the top gear. But apart from that, this is my Marin Mount Vision. So I am competing today on the Saracen team, uh, which is a little bit more old fashioned than the other bikes that I'm racing against today. But I'm, I'm quite confident in the choice because it has been carefully restored and set up with new cables, the gears are done, the bearings are all tight. Uh, I got it from Lifecycle in Derby, who are a charity who support access to bikes. Uh, they work with people in prisons to gain city and guild mechanical qualifications to do up bikes like this. So I'm quite confident that because it's a cheaper bike and everything's a bit more basic, I'm just gone for something that works and it's gonna last the whole Enduro day uh, and make up for the fact that the geometry is a little bit exciting, I'm a little bit scared. Um, but my brakes work, unlike some of the other bikes here. So fingers crossed that gets me out of jail. Uh, so I've got full Shimano SAS drivetrain, beloved by bike shop mechanics the world over, Shimano hubs, uh, got a Kenda Charisma front tire, which is looking like it's got plenty of life left. Schrader valves in case I need to go to the petrol station for some more air. Uh, fresh grips, saddles doing all right. New inner cables are shifting really well. Uh, so uh, it's just one of those bikes you see on tennis courts being wheelied in provincial towns everywhere in England. Crank Brothers pedals are maybe pushing it a little bit, but um, apart from that, it's ready to shred. Behold everyone, the mighty B-Twin Rock Rider 540S. The S stands for speed. Now, B-Twin being Decathlon's French brand in-house company, this thing is actually pretty modern and not too bad. So it cost me 160 pounds, so I went 10 pound over budget there. However, 27.5 inch wheels front and back, so it's fairly modern, 120 mil out back on an X-Fusion rear shock, SR Suntour's giving, I don't know how much travel up front, I'm gonna guess 120, maybe a bit, little bit more, it looks good, whatever. It's a good bike. Other notable features, check this out. Geometry, no, comfort geometry frame. Mmm, comfort, built for it, mate. So there are a few great notable parts on this, and there's some real design thought went into this as well. So obviously we've 
talked about the comfort geometry frame. Now, heat treated alloy aluminium, 6061 T6, very nice. Integrated headset, it even says so. Sealed bearings, people, and integrated disc brake mounts. That means the brake mounts are integrated. Unbelievable. It's a few signs of wear and tear, let's be honest. So, we've got no bar ends, uh, so probably going to core myself like an apple at some point. The back tire is completely bold. The chain gets sucked in all the time. I did say to the boys that you can stick on whatever pedals you want, because a couple of them didn't come with pedals, so we were like, we'll discount pedals. So, got some flats on there, but look at the wheels. Aero Trail Evo. Mm, yes. B-Twins, all-terrain lights as well. Even lighter because they've got absolutely no tread on them. And finally, oh, that's some squishiness right there. Right, time for the first challenge. Come on in, boys. Let's see what you got. Oh, God, no, please don't. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best does, thing uh, ever. Does it have a horn on it? Oh, it does. Nice. I mean, yeah. fellas, you've <laughs> crushed it. You've stolen my mum's bike. Yeah, so she that's cool. me right out. Yeah. yeah. She, me solid, but... <laughs> she would. Uh, goodness me. So wow. see, we've got a right bunch of rigs right yeah. here. Mm, yeah. Uh, you did wow. say enduro, full I, sus. I did. I said mm. enduro. Oh, was there was, oh okay. It was necessarily full sus. Okay. You, have, you smashed it, I'm <laughs> impressed. So, first challenge was price. Now, I set the price cap at 150. Yep. Mm. We're scoring today, lowest overall points at the end of the day wins. Yep. Point for first, uh, three points for third. Okay. In our upcoming challenges. First one was price, 150 quid. What did it cost you? 150 quid! Zero oh, well points done. for you because yes. you didn't go over. 130 quid. Oh, you went under, but you had 20 quid spare. So, zero points still. So, you're, you're not even on the board. How much did you cost? How much did that yeah. cost? Yeah. That's so, modern. 27.5, mm. that. This is 160. Ooh. Yeah. For, uh, 10 pounds over, one point for every five pounds. So, I've already got two points on the board. I'm on the back foot. All right. But it leads us to our next challenge agility. Challenge number two, people, agility. So enduro bikes, mm -hmm. yeah. they've got to do it all, right? right? They've got to be agile, nimble, get you up, get you down, which we're going to get to in a bit. Mm -hmm. They've got to have good handling as well. Yeah? Yep. yep. How do you yep. think about the handling on that uh, double-decker oh, bus of yours? prime, 22 inch, <laughs> right for it. Yeah, right. Well, here is the agility test. Right, time for a run through. So, along this skinny Loch Ness Monster along here. Ooh, holy moly. This way, come on. Along this way. Once you've balanced along there, you've got to balance along this thing, around the pile of rocks, back over the skinny, knobbly thing of doom, sprint finish, to here. Fastest time wins. Boys, here yeah. is where we're starting from. Ooh, very strong log. <laughs> Rich smash. Here is where we're starting from. That's what my bike's going to do. Yeah. And if you fall off of a section, you got to go back to the start of the section. The, clock, the clock keeps running. running. Okay. Clock keeps running. You don't get points, Evan. Yeah. Clock just keeps going. Rock paper scissors for first. How's this going to work? Watch this. One, two, three. No. Oh, I thought we went on three. You lost. You're yeah. up first, <laughs> Isaac. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Are you ready? Enduro. He's already protecting his. <laughs> yeah. Three, two, one. Uh oh. Oh. Uh oh. Oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh-oh. The gear changes. Oh! Oh, with the swizzle. Oh, it's a win, sir! 21, 22. Ready, Rich? Ready as I'll ever be. All right, three, two, one. Oh, my God, that was so loud. That was a good one. Oh! Oh! Oh, wow. Oh, my God, that thing's like pure death. Oh, it's oh. cracked over. Whoa. That was quick. That was quick. That was 1859. Wow. What happened in 1859? The B-Twin Rock Rider 540S was born. Wow. Ready, Blake? Ready, Blake? Yeah. Three, two, one. Ha! Oh, it's good! Oh, he's fighting. Oh, 
Oh, this is horrible. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. Oh, no. That's oh, horrible. No. <laughs> what have I done? Oh, my chain! Oh, oh Blake! My chain! <laughs> oh, oh. Cox ticket, mate. <laughs> they come on! That's. <laughs> Oh my lord! <laughs> my chain come That's off! That's not how you do it! Stop! Oh! Oh! oh. Well, you ain't. Ah, oh, no. That was terrible. That's a suboptimal performance, right? That's not a strong start. No, <laughs> it's not. One point, two points, three points to play. We'll tally these up at the end, but on to the next challenge. May have found a first quite large problem with the Rock Rider in that the front wheel just comes undone. This is after the... After the, 18 <laughs> seconds of riding. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, that doesn't fill me with confidence. So if there's an enduro uh, stage coming, you're going to have to yeah. stop and make sure that's tight. You want just mid-run. <laughs> my chain's going to come off. Yours just... You're like 16 foot in the air and my front I wheel's can, disappearing. I can see what's coming up. I'm that high. <laughs> Recognise this bad boy? Oh, yes, yes. speed gun. I've got good memories about that. Mm -hmm. Enduro racing gets wild, gets fast. But how fast and how fast can these things, and us included, <laughs> not fast. handle it? <laughs> well, let's find out. I'll go. Gun first. No, no, no all right then, go on. No, you'll go. Oh. Blake's volunteer. Right. <laughs> good job, that. Blake. Oh. I'll go on the gun. Cheers, Blake. Ah. <laughs> You volunteered yourself for doom. No, I, doom. Asked, I asked to do the gun. Doom! I asked to do the gun. <laughs> Holy sugar, I nearly saw 53k an hour. <laughs> that was well fast. Oh. oh, yes! <laughs> I broke it with my Justice butt. Justice has been served! I've broken with my butt. Justice! Oh. Finally, peace and quiet on this challenge. <laughs> Damn! Z50? How fast? Oh my god! He was the same as you. 53 as well! No way! Yeah, buddy! Yeah. 53s! <laughs> oh. oh! What? 54! Oh. oh, that is gutting. That is 54 wow. kilometers an hour! He's flying! It's possibly the scariest moment of my life! <laughs> yeah, you look pretty scared, mate. Absolutely horrendous! I felt like everything flexed. I felt like both tyres are going to explode. And then I thought, my wheel's going to fall off. Yeah. I, I, I say it's because of the 27.5s. And I had extra wind resistance because I forgot to do my flies up. <laughs> right, gents, time to get those saddles up because we're going climbing. What's that? Here we go. Behold! The climbing challenge, because as we know, in an enduro race, right, you've got to get to the top mm. to come back down. Yeah. So your bike's going to have to handle well, yeah. good gearing, good climbing technique. If you make it up, yeah, you win, obviously. Where's the top? The top is uh, up there. It's at the top, obviously. Right. Just uh, right, if yeah, you yeah, see yeah, up there where the, the top, top is. Yeah, if we've got a time, yeah. and or... if you make it, I'm going to time it as well, because I feel I might not make it, because my tire is slick. That is very I warm. feel like you guys might, so we are going to time it as well. Fastest man wins. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, I'm Ooh. not going first. No, it's just oh, between yeah, okay. you and I. One, two, three. Oh, oh, I go first then. Oh, damn it. All right, three, two, one, go. Danny Ho! Go on, Rick. <sighs> oh, yes. Go on. Slow and steady. Go on, Rick. Yeah, oh. go on. Oh, I forgot how steep it is. You're not going to make it. No, my gears are not working. You're not oh. going to make it. Oh, it's well steep. You're not going to make it. He's making Don't it. Don't fail me now, rear tyre. Go on, Rich. You got it. Oh. Phantom gear change. Go on, Rich. You got it. Oh, listen Something's to that. rubbing. Listen to that rub. Wow, he's actually making it. Oh, no. Oh. I'm going. Yes. OK. Wow, something nearly killed me. Three, two, one, go. Go, Blake! Come on, Ed. 
Oh, flip and stay over, really. Yes! Wow! Oh. Come on, buddy! Go on, you're nearly there. Come yeah. on! Yeah. Seven. Oh, he's out yeah. of the saddle! Six. Yeah. Oh, you're going to run, uh. Rich. Come on. Yeah. He's got uh. I can't take anything seriously with a horn. Oh, nice wow. effort. How did it feel? Oh, that was hard. 29.59. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, go on. I don't know what I did. I don't know what I did. <laughs> but congratulations! Yay! Yay! Right, gents, time to drop those seats because it's the That's final really countdown <laughs> doo -doo -doo -doo. <laughs> challenge of the oh. day. <laughs> This is obviously Cheap Bike Enduro Challenge, so it is time for the Enduro stage. Ooh. And I have got a doozy lined up for you. On, it's going to be a good couple of minutes. We've got a sprint at the beginning, yeah. a wild bit of downhill in the middle, and a fairly flat sprint finish. Oh, that sounds very Enduro. Very, janky. very Enduro. This is an Enduro Cheap Bike Challenge. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, oh three way tie. Scissor Brothers. One, two, three. Huh. Oh. Oh. I'm off first. Okay, well, um, you seen Blake? Oh, I think he's trackside, he's ready to heckle. Oh my lord, okay. Well, count us in, Isaac. Riders ready. Three, two, one. Up, 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 up. Oh my god, let's go. The boys are laid down heaters. As befitting any true enduro rider, I'm doing the open face and goggles, of course, and uh, I'm scared. V brakes, uh, yeah, let's go. <laughs> my own. Three, two, one, go.
Okay, boys, it's total in time. Oh, the challenges yes. are done. So, price, I was a £10 over, so that's a point per fiver. So yeah. I'm on two already. Zero. Zero. Zero, zero right? Zero. Oh, cool. oh, God, that's a zero. Ooh. Agility. I think I, I failed that. You, you so three points for you, Blake. Oh. Two. Two for yourself, Isaac, and one Oof. for me. Speed. Ooh. Ooh. I picked that one, didn't I? You yeah. won that. So one. Yeah, and two and, well. Yeah, two well, you've done two. a draw for the other two. Yeah, zero, so, zero, two, so and two, two and two. Two and two. Climbing, you were definitely, you smoked yeah. us on that one. So that's one for Isaac. I got second. Blake, you were second, I was third. Desirability. Now, on the desirability front, we had a whip round at lunchtime and asked whose bike would they have to take home? If you could only choose one. Yeah, you, Blake, you, you took that one, didn't you? I took that one. Yeah. Uh, I was second, yeah, sadly. I, I, I the, got uh, no votes. The Saracen <laughs> did not fare well. They didn't even know it was there. Uh, yeah, I don't think they really knew it was a good challenge, <laughs> otherwise they would have been, you know. And then the big one, the enduro stage. Ooh. So our minute and a half ish long stage. Now, mm. I believe Blake took top honours. 114, 115. Yeah. Oof, absolutely fine. Uh, where are you, Blake? You're Smoking. in the middle. Yep. I was a 18 and you were yeah. a 19, yeah. right? Close. Where are we? Two, three. Quick maths. Go, people. Two, three, four, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven for myself. I got nine. Nine for Blake. Isaac, you are two, four, five. Eleven as well. Eleven. Oh! Blake has taken yeah! it! Oh. The Marin! That, think, that was like revenge after the speed one we did, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah, it was, yeah. And we're I... just going to draw in every challenge. We're just yeah. drawing, yeah, same again. <laughs> Unbelievable. Look, do you want to see more challenges, everybody? Do you want to see us go head to, get a, head, to head again? Maybe an XC challenge. Let's keep going. No, let's, let's more downhill, please. More, yeah, no, I agree.